Well, it looks like the Via guy's going to take off. Maybe he's finished with the Lot Lizard. Maybe there's not a Lot Lizard in there. Who knows? But it sure does look suspicious, him being out in the middle of a parking lot. Like that for 25 minutes on private property. Kind of disrespectful to the synagogue as well. But hey, you know, Via does what Via wants. I mean, the signs up there say no unauthorized vehicles. And, uh, you know, but Via doesn't care about things like that. I mean, I'm parked out on the street. I'm not going to invade their private property just to uh, go up and confront a Via supervisor. Because we all know Via doesn't care about their uh, supervisors doing shady stuff. So, uh, again... Uh, you know, if I got a money shot of, a, of the lot lizard getting out, that would be great. But, uh, looks like he's going to be smart and drive off and drop her off down the block. Oh, wait, that's assuming there is a lot lizard in the truck. Maybe he's just doing his job and, you know, doing it from somewhere he shouldn't be. Doing good. I'm not, and I want that supervisor reported for threatening me. Uh, he was in 213. I know exactly who he is. Uh, okay, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry for coming off on you like that. But when your employees consistently do this, this guy for three months would come up and say, I'm going to call the police. You're going to get arrested. I'm like, I'm legally parked, dude. What is your problem? He, on the other hand, was unlawfully parked on private property for 40 minutes when he should have been on a public road or on via property. That wasn't the point. I never confronted him. He's out here giving me shit and threatening me with unlawful detainment and arrest. Thank you, though, for quickly ascertaining that I'm not violating the law and that I'm not doing anything illegal. Thank you very much. Do you need any help? No, what, the, the reason I came out here, okay, you, you know who I am and what I do. I film police all the time. I film in public all the time. Earlier, uh, I'm, I'm sure you're aware of it, all the crap that's going on in the Middle East, there are reasonable or uh, expectations that there may be uh, terroristic threats at religious centers. This is a religious center. I am simply documenting earlier the police presence and how they were doing a good job of deterring and reassuring the community uh, by being out front and present. I was in the process of uploading the via or the video. That's why I was sitting here, uploading it. And when your guy's over here, and he pulls out and he starts going, "Hey, are you broke down? Acting like he he wants to be my friend." The guy knows me. He he intentionally started making threats, and I'm like, "Dude, you need to go away. Call the police if you have a problem. Call SAPD." because this is a public street. Instead, he calls you guys, and hey, I understand you have authority here. I'm not disputing that or whatever. But again, when he tells me I'm breaking the law, he needs to be educated on the law. And I know he's the same son of a bitch who tried to have me towed from a parking meter and then told the guy he didn't pay for the parking meter. I'm sorry. You know, I don't even know your name. I'm going to Sorry, I... I am vocal about it because I'm tired of via employees treating the public like that. This guy's been way cool. Um, again, you know, he immediately came out, ascertained that I'm not breaking the law and I'm venting on him and that's not cool. But again, this guy in 213 does this shit all the time. And if I'd had, hadn't been uploading, I'd have documented his threats then. But of course, I was uploading. Right, 